Hi, I'm Joe Wadzak. And I'm Richard Siddle, and we're stuck in a dark cave in Romania. Peace and help. Actually, <laughs> actually, we're in Old Transylvania in Romania, drinking some of the best valley wines in the world at Cremella Rakash. It's going to be a good day, Chief. <laughs> Cheers. Hey Joe, so this is arguably one of the most important wine ranges that's been introduced in the UK I don't know, in the last I don't know, 10 years or so. This is from Marks and Spencer's. It's part of their found range, isn't it? It's sort of off, the, off the beaten track. And I think what's really exciting about this wine is a big retailer like M&S looking to go off the beaten track. Absolutely. And we're in Romania, we're sitting in this, in this, this cellar here of Cramel Recas. Yeah. And this is their, their Fetiasca Regala. Now, you know a lot more about Fetiasca Regala than I'll ever know, Chief. So, mm. would you mind introducing the wine? I don't mind if I do. <laughs> um, so, Fetiasca Regala means royal maiden or royal royal grape variety. Okay. And um, this wine, interestingly, the whole Marks and Spencer's found range, I've tasted them all. There's about 12 of the wines. Yeah. And they're really interesting grape varieties that you never they generally are give the track. time of day to. Yeah. But the labeling's great, the packaging's evocative. There's a photo of some Romanian yeah. national dress. And the wines are all good. Yeah. But if I was going to pick, genuinely pick the best value wine in the lineup, there's a couple of Greek whites, which are very cool. But this, Fetias Gala from Crown de Cash, is being sold to Mark Suspenses on the shelf at $7.99. And this wine is about as good a refreshing glass of white as you will find anywhere. And I will tell you this now that my, I tell my wife to buy it at Marks and Spencer's when she does the shopping. And when I get home, whenever she comes home and puts it in the fridge, she hides it from me because there's always that, that much missing. Because she's drunk it out of the bottle on the way home. <laughs> <laughs> it's that delicious. I know you yeah. see it. It's absolutely no, fantastic. No, 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 no. And I think that this epitomizes what makes this, this wine company uh, so know, interesting and so good. They, they know a good thing when they see it. And this is a delicious wine. But I know you, you, you spoke to me before about Fetty Ascarina, and it's like... Um, Fascinating that they should put their not not you know not just put it in a blend but no. to actually go for it. They're going champion this, yeah. champion this. You know varieties which are typically very difficult to pronounce, unusual varieties. It says in the back, Vin Varietal of Romania. Isn't that lovely? It's eleven and a half percent alcohol. By uh, way. No, it's not. It's not. It's, it's not going to give you a headache during the cricket if you have a couple of glasses of this. That's really? like really luscious, deep, fresh. Got loads of textures going going on. It's sort of, I don't know, it's, it, 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 it is different. I mean, it's like not what I'm used to at all, but it's also, can I ask more? You know, it's that kind of like Oliver Twist type wine. One of the things <laughs> that the Marks and Spencer's wine team does well, and one of the things that this company does well, is that this company makes wines which always over deliver in flavor. Yeah. Marks and Spencer's always managed to work out what's drinkable. Yeah. They, if this wine had more flavor, what's, yeah. you'd have one and go, yeah. add enough to you. But yeah. this wine is like, you get to the bottom and you're like, yeah. Can is there I any more? Can I have another glass? Yeah. It's so more. Get your bowl out. It's, so um, this is it. This is it. This is our premium supermarket wine retailer in Britain buying wine from here mm -hmm. at God knows what price, but the customer in the UK can buy this for eight pounds and it's a talking piece at a dinner party. That's how good it is. Yeah, and it's it's absolutely brilliant. And um yeah, I, I well hats off to M and S for doing this and yeah. obviously to Philip and his team at Kramer Rackhouse for for, for making it happen in the first place. So. And you know what? By the time I get off the plane, there'll be a Marks and Spencer. We're, we're, we're probably drinking another bottle this by the weekend. My wife and I. So cheers. <laughs> cheers. Delicious. Get it what you can. Mm. Mm. Give me more. Mm. So good. <laughs>